Hi everyone welcome back to my channel different view today it's like 80 degrees out and I said I'm gonna go on my front porch and film my haul video today it's too nice to sit inside I've been in all morning doing stuff so now it's time to come outside and enjoy it we don't get it for very long so anywho I have a haul video for you from an estate sale and from the Lewiston Antique Mall. Uh, I didn't get a real lot at the estate sale, but I got enough to where I spent like, uh, what was it? 140 some odd dollars at the estate sale. At the Antique Mall, I spent $190. So, um, yeah. So let's get into it because I've got some great stuff. All right, well, it's sitting right here. I bought two amazing afghans. Now, they have a, like a wool kind of a smell almost. I can't explain it. It's not, they're, they're, they're soft, but they're not soft, soft, you know? I think they need a, to just a washing and some fabric softener. And then they'll be really soft. But these are very big. So this would be like a normal size afghan. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, I don't really think she, she used these. So like this is the length, okay? And then double... <laughs> double the width. So, it is a beautiful afghan. And like I said, like brand new. I love it. Such pretty colors too. All right, let me just set that over there on the chair. Then I got this one. Now, I have never seen anything like this as far as afghans go. So look at this, you guys. Okay, so let me just show you the edging. The edging is all done in green, okay? So this is the edging. Now, I don't wanna spill my water. Let me move it over there. We have pink, blue and yellow, we have just a green and all white. We have one like this, purple and yellow. And then this color. And then we come back around this way. Hang on guys, I lost my spot. <laughs> Here we go. I'm showing it to you backwards, but you get the idea. So this is another very large Afghan. I did not measure them, but I will have them measured when I do my sale and have these for sale. Um, they're just gorgeous. Handmade goodness. Whew, that was a workout. <laughs> Holy cow. All right, now, this estate sale that I went to um, was a very old friend of mine. Um, I didn't realize it till I actually got in the house and started looking around, but um, she 
sold Avon for probably 40 years and her whole house was filled with Avon. And when I first started selling Avon, she was the first contact person um, that I talked with and she got me signed up both times that I sold Avon. And I would have all of my stuff delivered to her house because I worked during the daytime. And then I would go to her house and pick it up. Um, and her name was Joy. And unfortunately, um, three, I think probably like two, three years ago, probably three years ago, Joy was driving down the road and she was hit by a drunk driver and she was killed. And the weird part about it is not only did I know her, I also knew the driver that killed her because I worked with him. So it was a sad story all the way around. And it was, I just, I felt kind of glad to be in her home and purchasing some of her items because I knew her and she was such a wonderful person. So just thought I would share that with you. Um, yeah, I don't know. It was just, just kind of strange, but I did get some very cool items. So she made both of those afghans. Um, then I found these. These are fantastic. I got these glass drink stirrers. We have the um, Christmas wreaths and the holly and the berries. So I got two sets of those. I did get this awesome uh, cookbook for boys and girls. Look at the graphics on there. <laughs> I love this book. Uh, Golden Press, copyright 1957. Yes, it is awesome. And it actually um, has some, look at this. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what an awesome book. I had to pick that up. Had to. Okay, everything is sliding on these cushions. So I'm just going to set it on the ground. Okay, so I did buy this really pretty brooch. And it can be worn as a brooch or a necklace. And it has also an extra little bead there that you can hang from it as well. I just thought that was so pretty. I loved it. And this is an Avon uh, piece of jewelry. I also got myself, I used to have this very same ring sizer. And I, I don't know, I got rid of it. I don't know why I did. I, I could probably kick myself, but luckily I was able to purchase Joy's. And um, this comes in very handy, I can't tell you. Especially if I start getting into jewelry and stuff, at least that way I can tell people what the heck size the ring is or whatever. So yes, got that. She had, um, where did the other one? Oh, here it is. I had to get these. I don't know why. Because I'm not really a big fan of SpongeBob, okay? Because his laugh gets on my last nerve. But I do like Patrick. <laughs> but I got myself these SpongeBob socks with the little things that hang off the back outside of your shoe. <laughs> I could not help myself. <laughs> Yes, good old SpongeBob. And then I just got a pair of white uh, ankle socks. I got some uh, really nice golden books. We have Heidi. Little Golden Book of Hymns. Let's see, what year is this one? Uh, 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 it does have writing in it. Where is the copyright? 
14th printing, 1977. There's just writing, oh, there is some pencil writing in here, but that can be erased and it's only on the last, the last um, couple of pages there. So I can just erase that. And then the Heidi, this is from, uh, oh, those dang Roman numerals. MCM LIV, but um, this is in uh, excellent condition. There are no no uh, markings in it at all. Then we got the Little Golden Book, or a Little Golden Book, Forest Hotel, a counting story. That's cute. This one is from 72, and excellent condition the little book this one is from 1981 and this one is in great condition as well so just the one has a little bit of pencil scribbles in it um then i got a set of beautiful doilies look at these There's that one. It's a nice size one. Then there is this one. It matches. Um, so I got those two. And then, where did the other one just go I had? Oh, there it is. I got this one. Now, hopefully, I mean, it does have a little couple of little, some staining in the center. But look at how pretty this outer is. Isn't that beautiful? So I'm going to see if I can maybe soak this and see it's got, see if I can get that out. I did get some of these cute uh, items. Little pot holder. I got that one. And I love the little dresses. Look how cute. This one has some hair on it. Aren't those adorable? I love them. You're going to hear my wind chimes. I love listening to that sound, especially at night. Then I got this really cute uh, Halloween towel for myself. I just thought it was adorable. I got these. Um, I, I don't have a a uh, obviously I can't plug them in and show you. These go on your outlets. They are night lights. Look how pretty they are. They're like stained glass. So these are, these are um, cloisonne items, these next items that I'm going to show you. And they're just absolutely beautiful. Hang on just a second, I just want to get this off, if I can. If I can. There we go. Um, Originally, this was $22. Look at that. And I did pay up for these cloisonne items because it was the first day of the sale. And I knew they would be gone if I didn't grab them. So, and it has the box that it came in. Sorry guys, I got tangle, tangle, whatever. I'll get it off eventually. 
bought anyways. We have this beautiful egg. Gorgeous. Um, they all come in their original boxes. Sorry, put this in here. Whoop. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Just extraordinary. Absolutely stunning. All right. Then I got this box of, there is tissue, or not tissue paper, bubble wrap. They're brand new in the package. I'm just going to show them to you without, because they're taped, I think. Um, maybe I could get the tape off. Maybe not. I don't have any fingernails. But it's two packages of hand-blown glass candy. I know it's really hard to see them, but like I said, I don't have anything out here to cut, to cut the tape with, so. But. All right. Uh, Joy was a lover of cats. She had several cats of her own. So I did grab some cat stuff. <laughs> we have this gorgeous Siamese cat figurine. Uh, he's Avon, 1984. This also is Avon, 1984. <laughs> Look at that smile. <laughs> and they're in perfect condition. Uh, then I got a set of three of, no, there's just one of these guys. Yeah, because the other two are bears. Oh, no, these are all bears. So we have some smalls. So this is the little honey, the little honey hive, the beehive. And then we have three little tiny bears. Look how little. <laughs> uh, these are Bone China by something Japan. What does that say? Bridge, Bridge, Japan. So we got that little set. Then I got this cute little guy. <laughs> no markings. Then I got this amazing, amazing set of elephants. All trunks up. That's the mama. And we have two babies. They're all in excellent condition. These are these are definitely porcelain. Um yeah, they're, look at that little face. <laughs> they're so cute. Look at them. So I got those. 
And then I got a set of gray tabbies. He's a little guy. <laughs> and this one. Oh, they're just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. So, those are the littles. Get in here ever so carefully because especially the elephants, the ears are very, very delicate. So I just got to be very careful putting them in here for now. All right. Then I got this adorable uh, it holds a rosary. For those of you who are Catholic, you definitely know what the rosary is. <laughs> For my daily prayers. And then um, I was telling the people, I was talking to someone, one of the people that was running the estate sale, and I happened to glance over and see this and I was trying to get away from her as quickly as possible so I could grab this before somebody else did. So I was talking to her and walking away from her at the same time. <laughs> yes. Now, this is supposed to be white. However, uh, Joy's husband was a very heavy smoker, and um, so it's not white anymore. It looks, you know, I don't know if somebody wants to try and clean the fur, like, ever so carefully, but, um, yeah. But she's in excellent condition, and she is a left in peace. So... I actually have another one of these and I by accident knocked her over and broke her neck off and had to re-glue it. So that will be a scratch and dent sale <laughs> item. So there's our little poodle. She's awesome. Um, I did get, now she also, besides selling Avon, I believe she also either sold or she bought because there was a poop ton of it in the house, a uh, princess house. Yeah, I'm sure many of you remember a uh, princess house. So these were all from princess house. We have a kitty cat. We have an owl. Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> we have a little doggy. And a turtle. They all have their stickers except for the kitty. The kitty does not have his sticker for some reason. I don't know why. And I also got, now these are all weighed turtles. This one is actually a trinket box. So we got one, two,
and a little bitty one. <laughs> so I got those. Put that in here. I got a gorgeous perfume bottle. So pretty. And then I got this set, which is also Princess House. There is a sticker on the tray. Absolutely stunning. I'll show you the tray as well. This is a little trinket box. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh. <laughs> what a save! <laughs> hmm. And that is the tray it's that they sit on. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let me put this away. <laughs> Holy cow, that was a close one. All right, and, oh my God, I just dropped the owl, but he's good. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, what in the heck is wrong with me today? All right, and the last thing that I got is the best thing of all. Now. I tell you guys all the time, I never, ever, ever find these. So we're outside, went out in the backyard and they had all kinds of tables set up with all different stuff. And I look in this box and I see these and I immediately, well, almost immediately, Pooped my pants. Yes. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe that I found these candles. I was in shock. Got a pair of gold and a pair of clear. Now I can scratch Lucite candles off my bucket list. <laughs> OMG. So, that was 140 some odd dollars worth of goodness. Absolute goodness. All right, so I'm just going to slide this stuff over a little bit because I have, oh, I have the uh, Lewiston Antique Mall haul to do with you very quickly. So this is probably gonna be another hour video, unfortunately, but I can't help it. Oh. All right. Oh my goodness. All right. So let's start with this box. Um, I saw this and I absolutely love this. Now it is not marked uh, Tanala or Talavera, but it is an awesome piece of uh pottery and I know you're not going to be able to see it the paint glows I can't show it to you out here is this working it is but you're not it's very hard to see there you go see the glow on the green but anyways yes and it is this awesome frog 
and I just love him. I, I'm thinking I might keep him for myself. Sorry, Larry. <laughs> but he is awesome. I love it. So that's piece number one. Now, these will be for my buddy Larry. These are made in Capuano, Vancouver. Well, it says Capuano, Vancouver, but they're stamped Japan on the feet. Oh my goodness, are those cute or what? Oh dear. <laughs> those are awesome. I saw those and I said, I have got to get those. And then I saw this adorable Cocker Spaniel figurine. He's just sitting there so proud. He or she, I don't know. He's not marked, so I really have no idea. It just says 79 on there. But, um, I do see some, hair, these are some hairlines, but they're not affecting, they're not going all the way through. Oh, wait a minute, I lied. It does go all the way through. It sure does. It's going up here and up there. So there's another scratch and dent item, but he's still adorable. Oh my word. It is, it's a Puda Snooda. It's a Puda Snooda. Planter. Redware. I believe it's Redware and it is Japan. Yep, it's definitely Redware. It is awesome. What a fantastic piece. <laughs> Love it. Now, I found one of these at the Goodwill, and I found another one at an antique store. This is made by Tilso, Japan. It is this little hobo guy, and I believe my friend Cynthia bought the last one that I had. <laughs> so darn cute. Then I got <laughs> Go Parking. <laughs> I believe it's either an ashtray or a change uh, dish. But it's uh, made in occupied Japan and it is awesome. <laughs> And then I got this set. Oh my word, these are cuter than cute. Look at that, it's a fireman boxer. And he's got his two kids with him. <laughs> Oh, they are adorable. They're not marked on the bottom either, so I have no clue who makes them. I just know they're cute. Then I found these. I just, I love the color. Why is there a string? Look at these. They're salt and pepper shakers. There's their little stoppers. I just had to get them for the color. They're awesome. They're little, but they're awesome. 
This is 1985 Taiwan. And it is this adorable little stocking holder, little puppy. Look at that face. <laughs> I had to get him. I couldn't help myself. I could not help myself. That is a beauty. Absolutely gorgeous. I didn't see any uh, issues, no chips or cracks. Voila. Yep. A Fenton white hobnail fairy lamp. Has a few little flea bites around the rim up on the top. They, I don't know. Most of them usually do. I don't know why, but it's in excellent, excellent condition. Should I do a thumbnail? All right, me and my goofy thumbnails. Yes, ma'am. It's not, it's not broken though, so I don't know what that's all about, but it's really in phenomenal shape. There's a little bit of little rust on the bottom there. This is from 1973. Set that over there. Yep, $190.19. Daisy and button pattern in this gorgeous blue. I don't feel any issues. It is gorgeous. This is absolutely stunning. Isn't that gorgeous? Show it to you up close. I just love the forget-me-nots. I think they're so pretty. <laughs> Isn't she gorgeous? Oh my word. She is just a beauty. She's got little flowers on her bonnet. Oh, she's so cute. She's one of those ones you just can't leave sitting on the shelf. I love this Toby mug because of the colors. First of all, his face is amazing. It's absolutely amazing. He looks so real. Uh, he's not marked either, but he's, it's a good size cup too. Mm -hmm. He is just, he's gorgeous. Look at that face. I can't even, just tell me he doesn't look real. I can't get over it. It's so cool. Again, forget me nots. This is a hair receiver. It's made in Austria. There's the lid. 
It's in excellent condition. The inside is a beautiful mother of pearl. And there is also this piece that I believe goes with it. This is beautiful. Now this does not have mother of pearl. I don't think it goes together. But, I, but it could go together. But I don't think it does. But it is gorgeous. And look at these little details. Absolutely. This one is hand painted by E. Scott. 19... Can't, I can't read the last two numbers because something happened there. I don't know what happened, but... I don't know, but it is a beautiful piece nonetheless. And you could actually pair them together if you if you wanted to, but they definitely do not match. They are totally different. They have different leaves, different colors, but they're gorgeous. So I will sell those separately. I got this amazing planter and I'm sorry, I just think that this is stunning. Is this not beautiful? gorgeous just gorgeous uh this is yukago it says from mark christmas 2003 very pretty beautiful piece This, I think, is amazing. Now, there's some sticker on the bottom, but I don't think it's marked. Oh my word. she gave me this isn't that pretty it's not an antique but it is still beautiful and I know Paula she likes her blue it's a gorgeous bowl that would be so nice with fruit in it or something very pretty piece. Very, very pretty piece. All right. She also gave me this mirror that the uh, the dresser pieces were sitting on. She goes, oh, you could take the mirror too. Go ahead. I said, okay. <laughs> no problem. Um. So then I saw this. Now it's it needs cleaning. It's dirty, okay. But it is the Virgin Mary. And she glows, but you can't tell outside. But she does. And she's like a very thick, a very thick like resin or something. I thought it was very cool. I'm so mad that you can't see the glowing outside, but you'll see it when I show, you know, have her in a sail. Uh, let me see, I need my water. I only have, uh, one more item to show you guys. Cool. 
this is an awesome piece and it is in fantastic condition. Yes. Treasure craft. Yep, I got some awesome pieces at the Lewiston Antique Mall. I absolutely did. And I just love the colors in this. I am ecstatic with everything that I got. I think, um, I think I did pretty well. Um, so let me know what you guys think. What was your favorite item? What was your least favorite item? Do you think I spent too much? Do you think I spent enough? I don't know. Whatever you would like to say, leave a comment. Um, I'm going to be filming another video right after this one. So you will notice me being in the same spot in the same clothes. Yes. We're banging them out. We are banging them out because I'm tired of looking at the stuff all over my living room floor. <laughs> so, uh, let me see. I'm having my usual sale Saturday, three o'clock Eastern Saturday. Um, what else do I have going on? Nothing. I don't think. I think that's it, just my sale on Saturday. But there will be more haul videos to come. And I'm also gonna film a video on how I'm going to fix my little lady head figurine who was missing half an eyelash and one of her fingers. So that will be coming up as well. Uh, I also have plans to do a live Q&A video. Um, I just have to find a time that's good where I'm not running into other people's sales. So when I figure out when I'm going to do it, I'll let you know. All right, guys, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.